Boom. And we're back with part two. Creepy door. Yeah, so. Now, uh, I can just continue this up from the last one. The difference between that one and this one is that I have a fresh hot cup of coffee and it's delicious. So, we are investigating creepy room because someone was screaming and dying and ooh, this looks important. All right, <gasps> is it the Omni Tool? I have Omni Tool. I'm just gonna have that. Ah, I'm in it too. I think I'm important back here. You're missing your face! It's kind of a problem. Hey! So, I assume, using my awesome game logic thing, it is an advanced interface for accessing, managing, and controlling computerized systems. The onboard intelligence includes. An open set of behaviors and protocols to enable the user to automate routines, actions through basic logic charts. Over time, the Omni tool will automatically adapt its programs to cover subconscious behavior to optimize work and minimize user error. Short range signals for useful basic or automated actions such as opening doors, complex operations should be physically connected to workstation or terminal. Simply slide operators into the main auxiliary slot connector. Something, something, something. Neato, I guess. Screwdriver? Ooh, I could be like Doctor Who! I have a screwdriver! Alright. Ah. Uh, is this another data thing? Download? No. Spending all of my time chucking things left and right. Getting nowhere fast, that's for sure. Lighty light? Huh. Alright, whatever. Ha! I have an Omni Dude. I did it. Um, oh. Helper Jane. Service console up to three. Yeah. Including pilot seat activated. I don't know what that means, but okay. All right. Blah, 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 blah. Thirteen days remaining. Well, that's not good. Can I go back? Back. Well, that's not a crevice. Blah 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 blah. So operation unavailable. Manage. Okay, not fitted with the tool chip. Thank you. Uh, not fitted with the chip. Uh, not too bad. I know they told you that field technicians would get full access throughout Pesos 2. I'm here to tell you that's not gonna happen. Don't get me wrong, I don't wanna get in your way. We need you guys to keep this place up and running, but there needs to be at least some level of security on these things. I don't want to hear you barge into some quarantined area at Omicron and just knocked out the whole place with some virus or whatever the hell they're doing over there. This is what you can do. You'll be able to use it to open doors, basically all of them. If you can't, there's something wrong or someone didn't want you in there. Then what do you do? You shove that Omnitool into a terminal and see if you can't get around it somehow. I mean, sometimes you'll need to get into places where you this don't belong. very frank. Just find a way. You're an engineer for crying out loud. What else? Take care of your gear. Don't be an asshole. That's about it, really. My name is John Strohmeyer, Pathos 2 security operative. I got an office at Theta. Come see me if you got any issues you can't handle yourself. Will do. Alright, so that was fun. I opened a toolbox. Alright. Tool chip found. Oh. Oh. What about another one? Alright, whatever. 
Vanish to chap. Up that. Security cipher updated. So, uh, is that what I said? No, well, 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 I guess that's it. That's all I need that for. Now, let's go poke this console with it. Here we go. And in practice. Uh, am I supposed to make sense of this? Maybe not. Construct it. Okay. Right. Aha! Something useful! Uh, poor Uncle feels nausea after the mission dice show a spike of electromagnetism surrounding the pilot home, which is believed to be the cause of symptoms. It's become increasingly unreliable. Everyone has been using it the last couple months is having headaches. Gavin was knocked out for 30 hours. Jesus. I don't even know what this thing does, but okay, we'll play it for the time being to show you. Now, the usage of the pilot system. You have to do some more heavy lifting, performing the operations through programming and physical labor. No one is happy about this, so don't bother complaining. Uh, okay. So a lot of bad things are happening. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Breathing? Alright, whatever. Moving in. That seems fun. Close this door. Moving in. Whoa. We're underwater. I kind of knew that, but that's what's messed up. But I mean, water. suspicious that uh, I'm just kind of showing up from a place taken over by psychotic machines back and different thick structure gel they can't shake walls creaky fishes Thing is everything sticks the same. All silence alike. Not gonna lie, it's a bit disconcerting, but some of those pictures had like fish with crazy goop gaba like on it. Okay.
What was that? It doesn't hurt anymore. What? What's going on? Uh, uh. All right, so are you not gonna call a question to um? Where did that go? Okay, whatever. I uh, uh, call a question to things being all weird and the door talking back and even zapping ya. It's a bit weird. Got, game got hung up there for a bit. We good? Let me check. I gotta make sure. Okay, still recording. Ugh, I don't even trust my own recording software. Look at this guy. All right, we're going. Ah, I just had to get a nice little sip. sip. Seems good. Is there even like something there? It's just like random lights. Be just hallucinating. I don't know where to go. Maybe. Not there. All right, that's fine. Whatever. If you do. like a good place to go if you want to like you know figure out what the heck is going on the video man the 12 minute one oh it's so good don't touch the structure gel leakage can't confirm its effect on wow issue has been reported to okay don't touch the gel get it get it but uh yeah hey hey can you hear me hello Okay, so obviously it's drawing attention to this. Shlip. I don't take orders from nobody! Oops. Nobody! I need it. Well, you wouldn't answer me. Okay, now I feel a little bit bad. Sorry about that. I'll, uh... Anyway. Da -da -da -da. Manual boot sequence. Do I just push the button? Oops. Oh! You have to think about it. Alright, alright, fine. It's not happening, apparently. Oh, what is it? What, what's happening? Hello, is there anyone there? Yeah. Hey, hey, can you hear me? I hear you. Uh, Absalom, what's going on? Everyone's dead! <laughs> 
I, I have no idea. I, I just sort of woke up here. Hey. In the room right now? Uh, it, it, was, it was like a, a seat with a helmet. Is that right? Uh, what's your name? I, I'm Simon Jarrett. And what do you... Oh, so, damn Leroy's. Where are you now? Uh, 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 some place dealing with electrical power. I, I'm not sure if it's a plant or a transformer. Uh, yeah, you're probably in a thermal plant somewhere. You want to go upstairs to the comm center. It's the room with the dome ceiling. Uh, hey, look, look, this place is not... There's something seriously wrong here. Hello? I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. We lost another relay. Just listen, head for the comm center upstairs. I'll wait here. Here's this. Surprisingly clean mugs. Um, okay, so I did that. You know, I'm kind of curious. Now that I've like turned on the power, maybe I can like. Do something else. Let's find out, shall we? Uh, probably just opened all the doors for Mr. Monster to come and get me. Chicka, 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 chicka. Mm. Process cooling. Oh, dang it. That was worth a try. Maybe that's some weird glowy effect. Can you stop shaking? Uh, I can't. Uh, might as well check the exhaust thing. Maybe it opened up since I turned on the power. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, I'm just wasting time. Oh yeah, so anyways, the 12 minute video that I mentioned earlier, is it I don't know, it was awesome because it was the last reward for the, um, the uh, alternate reality game that they did, the ARG, uh, which I don't know if anybody knew about that, but there was a little thingy thing going on where you could like solve puzzles, uh, like solve cryptexes and like all this stuff, decipher hidden images and things, it was actually really fun. And uh, the final reward, the final puzzle was a YouTube video link in the end. 12 minute video. I had this little segment in it. Really cool. Really interesting. But, uh, it has been said, it has been said that just because events happen in that video doesn't mean they'll always happen. Wait, is that a thing already? There's a thing already. What the crap? Crazy shuffle shuffle. Uh, it looks slow. 
But I don't think he is slow. again. I'm lying, of course. This is just going terrible. I've already got a freaking stalker on my butt. What happens if I poke that? That's a good thing to do. Log in. Okay. Of course. Oh, I wish I remember that video. I don't. Oh, yeah, press this button. Check terminal for details. I would, but it's locked. So thanks for your assistance, note. Not helping anybody out. Oh, here's a button. Workshop. Excellent. Uh, you're not one of the ones I can touch, are you? Right. Critical system failure. Re please reboot the workstation. going on in this game. Okay, this is a crazy whip wop. Just keep exploring. Hello? Buttons. Um hidey spot. Great! Hidey spot. Probably means I'm gonna be chased by something. Oh god, he's dead? He's dead. You're dead. Hey look, Simkin Faro. Did you get the final backup turbos going? Everything is wired evenly. We've hedged our bets as much as we possibly can. So that's it. Enough power to run Pathos 2 until the next apocalypse. We're ready to go. Excellent. I really hope we didn't mess anything up. I don't want to have to come back here again. Relax, it's over. We're going to Theta. Maybe we should see. 
few more blobs. I don't trust the helpers to let this place run in peace. We've sealed everything. Everything from the barracks to the comm center. If anyone ever sets their foot here again, they're gonna have a hell of a time getting a rock off. I sound like the same run. was the same run. Flow control? Read this. I can't. Sorry. Uh, where do I go? So, anyways, next apocalypse. Sealing everything. Seems like if they knew if I was coming, they wouldn't seal me in. We sealed Epsilon to keep it working. Don't F it up. Carl was not my fault. What the hell does that mean? Carl was not my fault. Ooh, Amy. Uh, 0735. I need to start writing these things down! If anybody's like, why the heck are you writing these down? That terminal is asking for IDs. It's an ID. Is there anything behind it? Maybe. Secret message. Uh, Alright, so I found Amy and Carl. Well, I haven't found Amy yet. Carl's kind of dead. That's what. Uh, pressurization hazards. That blood! Zeppelin cargo transport. Uh, let's see. Epsilon to beta. Alright, if I press this button, am I gonna die? Bleep! Yeah, it was worth a shot. It was the worst that was gonna happen. Mind your head. Okay, so. So. What does I do? I write down this guy's ID. Zero seven two. Seven two two. Something's trying to like get its way in. I'll check it out. I'm gonna use the console. And hey, check it out. Oh, someone scribbled that up. Don't, don't go there. Through maintenance pump room. Oh. You stop the shaking. That makes sense of what's going on here. Okay, so ID number change. Let's try Amy zero seven three five. Okay. Hey, up. Hey. Okay, we've, uh, we'll do this. Good job. Yes, we managed to link most backup turbos, activate all the generators. Upsilon should be able to produce power for at least a decade before we start burning through the flues. The bad news is the machines are getting worse. We tried to come up with a way to shut them all down. Considering the same amount of units at Upsilon, it's not looking good. Seriously worried they could disrupt power production when we leave. Any ideas? Try to get all the backup turbos running and cut production to 60%. All the evacuations, we can survive on low and steady hum. We need to strain the system. We should be able to get 20, 25 years on production before we have to fall back on the turbos. Robots are getting increasingly erratic all over Pathos 2, and unfortunately, there's no universal kill switch scene. And we won't return to Epsilon. You can try sealing off sectors to prevent the helpers from getting to the sensitive areas. Interesting. Shut down one of the highlighted sections to divert power to the communications center. See it there, down to the left. Okay, what about this? That's easy. That's also easy. 
Um, what if I logged in as what's this? What's this face? Zero seven. Yep, oh, I messed it up. Zero seven two two. Okay. Okay. Status. Um, production level sixty percent. That's good. That's what we we're supposed to set it at. Heat shield burnout. Quake disturbance. Zombie car blackout. Back. It's not here. Oh! That went. That's probably what they did. Just log out. That's it. Alright. Uh, stack. Any name I remember? Amy. Carl. Some other people missing. Don't know what those are, but they're not getting power. What is getting power? It's this thing. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Anything in here? Anything worth getting in here? Okay. Black box. Black box is precision instrument designed to observe your overall condition. There's water data from body temperature to brainwave activity related to pathos. Warden units at the station can provide you the appropriate climate for a situation. Great. So it. Whoa, wait, wait. Ooh. Um, this looks shiny. Okay. I might need this. I use it. So, uh, can I not use those? Something? Black box? Maybe? Something? Alright, whatever. Okay, that's how we're gonna play it. Alright, shit. Poke it! Poke it! Do it! Ugh. I don't know what that is. But it is something. Amy, is that you? What happened to the pilot scene? I could use some help. That robot's talking to me. Just ignore it. Just ignore it. It's not real. It's not real. It's not real. It's not real. We're just going crazy. You had brain damage from woke up on a Place in the water. What do you think happened to me? Come on. What are you? Are you blind? It's me. Carl. Carl Semkin. Wrangler. Any of this sound familiar to you? I know, actually. Well, kind of. Oh, I mean, it didn't mean so that. helpful. It's not like I'm knocked out on the floor or anything. Yeah, I'll just stand up there, are buddy. Are you human? Shit. Did, did my body give it away? I try hard to say a mystery. Yeah, I'm human. Are you? Uh, my name is Simon. Do you know anything about this place? Oh, you knew. That makes us slightly less weird. Are you not worried about Look, that? I'm obviously hurt. If you see anyone else around, just tell them where I am. So, where are you exactly? Are you for real? <laughs> I'm right here. See me when the robot thinks he's a person. Hey. Buddy. Okay, okay, I, I'm just, I'm just gonna be, I, I'm not seeing it. I, I see a machine, a robot talking. What the hell are you looking at? I'm here, see? Uh, okay, I, I just didn't expect you to look like that. You're really hung up on appearances, you know that? I... How did you hurt yourself? Not sure. Blacked out pretty bad. Can't remember how I got here. What do you remember then? I was in the pilot seat, promoting a UH. UH? A universal helper. You know, a robot like these things, but livelier. Anyway, I was just dealing with some heat shields, and that's my last clay memory. You were remote controlling a robot. We do it all the time. Robots are too on a way to deal with some stuff. Intuition doesn't grow on motherboards, you know. Did you maybe get trapped in the robot somehow? Your mind is pretty tightly wired to the helper, but... Nah, pretty far-fetched. Listen, I don't want to alarm you, 
but I think you might be trapped in a robot. I'm telling you, get your eyes checked. I'm right here. I see both my hands, both my feet. When you remote, all you see is like a video feed from the helper unit. Your own body is entirely out of the picture. Find someone who can help. If you see any others, just let them know where I am. I just realized I can't see my feet and I was in the chair and... My robot! Can you... Hello? Can you hear me? It's me, Carl, calling from the floor. Wait, we're in the next someone who can help. Alright, well, I'm gonna shut this off. Okay. I can't move. I I'm sorry. I I think I pulled the wrong lever. Oh, don't sweat it. Just get me a doctor. Won't a mechanic make more sense? You're trying to be fucking funny. <laughs> Give me a medic. But you're a robot. Really? The robots have legs, hands, a face. You're delusional. Okay, calm down. I I won't. You get some fucking help. Don't touch me. I don't know what the heck is going on here. He's a robot. He's a robot, or I'm a robot. One of those. Just one of those. Ugh. Okay, so now this is working. <gasps> wait, 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 that console thing. I gotta go check that console thing, because it wanted to reboot, and now I turned the power off. Hey. It's working. Yep. Yeah, it was worth a shot. What are you gonna do? All right. Going in the mysterious door. There's a uh, thing in there. I didn't pull the lever, but the power certainly has seemed to have stopped. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Harvey's not helping. Are you gonna walk? You're gonna walk in here. Got this little like joggy jog thing for this. Yeah, don't mind me. I'm just gonna like sneak in here like it ain't a thing. Power manager.
wish I could like go between this little slice like here, but I can't. Because I'm a giant robot and I don't know it. Making a lot of racket for Just seems to be chilling there. What the heck? Is he stuck? I think he's stuck. easy and I didn't leave the other guy suffering. Uh, sure. Let's restore some files. Yeah, why not? Let's do it. Just ran away from a killer robot. I can take a breather. Jonesy has an evac coming along. We've got everything we need to move, but we can't leave the plant without supervision. Adams decided to leave Amy, Asaro, and Kalsamkin to execute the automatization process. And I bet they're thrilled about it. I just wanted to let you know we're on schedule and I'll talk to you tomorrow. All right, I'll pass on the mold check. Jonesy, well, I'm going for an evac, am I right? It will do. I wanted to introduce you to Amy and Co. They'll be doing the talking as soon as I leave for Theta. Say hello. Hey, Theta. Hello. Hey, guys, I'm Peter Strass, doing dispatcher at Theta. Just let me know if there's anything I can do to help. I suppose that's it. I'll see you real soon. When we arrive. All right, Johnson, have a safe trip. Hey, hello, Theta? Absalon, what's up? We could really use direct contact with Heather. Uh, I mean, uh, Site Service Engineer Wolchek. Direct links are almost impossible to establish. The Luar relays are basically junk at this point. You could send messages via the comm center. If you want, I'm pretty much always here, ready to relay anything by hand. I know it's a shitty system, but it's all that works right now. All right, we just have to make two. Got you later. Hello? Peter, was it? Yeah, I'm here. What's up? We're getting out. I just want to tell you that I'm going to seal the comm center now, so this is definitely the last you'll hear from us. If we don't show up in the next couple of hours, send in the cavalry. Hang on, what's happening? It's still the same plan, right? Yep. We'll head for the shuttle and ride it directly to Theta. Okay, good. I'll rally the troops for a welcome party. Yeah. <laughs> I like the year. So, stuff and things. Um, there's a button. I love buttons. There's, this stuff important to read. You just click at me. This is like some Fallout machinery stuff going on there. It's pretty cool. Uh, the office is closing down. Everyone's being evacuated from here. I want to say it's been an honor working with you and Upsilon. Godspeed. The apocalypse. So the apocalypse really did happen. Um, oh, this is like 2100? I just noticed that. Uh, global community to prevent collision has failed. Bathos 2 should make any final efforts to deal with the inevitable wake of public impact. Sounds like a meteor or something hit. The office will close and I can no longer support Upsilon Pathos 2. I'd like to take somebody. Thank you, supervisor and the rest of the staff. It's a group and it's great confidence. I say, when we fall, you will surely carry on with bravery. I know you have a much better chance for style, but we have the better view. North America. We must be there. Or there. Uh, where are these? No. All right. Uh, let's just let's call myself. <laughs> All right. So I know I'm supposed to call Theta, but I don't.
Hey, are you there? I found the dome ceiling. Oh, that's better. Simon, was it? Oh, that's where I was supposed Jared, to Jared, Simon Jared. All right. Hi, Simon. I'm Catherine. Have you figured out what's going on yet? Nope. Me. I was hoping you'd have some answers. Yeah. I probably have some. What do you want to know? Kill a robot? Where do you even begin? I mean, what is this place? How did I get here? And, and why do the robots talk like they're people? Well, you're at Upsilon, clearly. Have you never been there before? Where did you work? The Grimoire in Toronto. Is that really important? No, I mean, where did you work at Pezos 2? I don't know what that is. That's unexpected. Did you come directly from Toronto? Yeah, I did. And it was very unexpected. Have you seen any people? Like, staff or field He's technicians? Killing robots and Only dead robots. People. Crazy ones. This is also strange. No doubt. You're telling me. What was that? No! What's going on? I think this place is about to collapse. What do I do? Simon, come to Lambda. Uh, how, how do I get there? Shit! Shit! Where do I... Where should I... Oh, fuck! Oh, God! My dead! I'm dead! Uh-oh, I lost the game already. Well, that was fun. I tried my best. I did my best. I did my duty! Get out of the country! Oh, I'm alive! What the hell? How is this possible? This isn't... This is insane! I... Uh... I'm apparently fine. The thing underwater, because apparently I was wearing a suit the whole time. Ah. Uh. Why? Oh, there's an option there. Got it. Helly oop and just kind of. All right, just blow up. Well, I mean, it's possible I was wearing that this entire time. I just failed to do this. I guess. But I'm pretty sure I'm a robot. Pretty sure I'm just a crazy, insane robot. And as soon as someone sees me, they're going to just shoot me in the head. That's where I need to go. <gasps> that's that door. Ooh, that's why I didn't open. Lambda, find the shuttle to Lambda. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm underwater, man. I want to explore. I want to see. I want to do things. Except, I'm out of time. I'm out of time. I'm gonna have to end this episode here. Well, I'll pick it up. Underwater Adventures with yours truly, The Biscuit. Until then, see ya!